we are up, live. Okay, so you guys know that Joshy B and I love food, right? That's and we love facts. things that taste good. That's okay? facts. And like, if there's one thing we're gonna do, we're not gonna sacrifice a good tasting something to be fit. <laughs> like, we so, literally care so much about our food. Like, sometimes we always joke with each other, we're like, we are so thick. But today, we are gonna show you guys how to make a healthy alternative to something that you might do daily to help you reach your protein goals. Maybe if it's like you're trying to lose a little bit of weight, this small right. change can help you um, move in a positive Positive direction, Let's go. but without sacrificing the taste. Coffee with a K brought Coffee. to you by the one and only Katie. Katie B. The queen barista. Okay, but no, basically I'm gonna show you guys how I make my go-to protein coffee. So for me, it's a really good way to get protein in, and then it also is a good way to like cut out some of the calories and sugar that is in coffee. When and you why do we flavors. need protein? Huh? Why do we need protein? To gain muscle. For the gains. For the gains. And honestly, protein is just so good. I feel like a lot of girls, especially, uh, just not to call you guys out, but I know a lot of my friends, like in girls, they're really bad at getting protein in um, in their diet, and that leaves them like. Oh no, she didn't. Oh no, just, like, she didn't. And not did. feeling as good. And so, like, if you want to feel your best self, you got to make sure you get your protein in. You got to make sure you are taking care of yourself. And I know you girls love your coffee. If you're like me, you love your coffee. So we're gonna show you how to get so it. So <laughs> I was gonna say kill two birds with one stone, but I don't really like that saying. Yeah, why do we gotta kill <laughs> that the birds? That sounds kind of mean, we doesn't kill it? We kill birds with our freaking windows. They're always flying into <laughs> the windows. They do run into our windows. And I'm like, maybe we shouldn't clean our window. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Anyways, coffee is okay. Let's go. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys how to make two different versions. One, we're gonna do if you are a regular coffee drinker, how to make it, and then we're gonna do if you like your fancy coffee. You know, if you like americanos or lattes, all that stuff. I'm gonna show you guys how to make it with um, espresso as well. The first thing that's important is you gotta know what kind of flavor you like in your coffee. If you're a caramel girl, then I would go with a caramel latte a protein powder. First form is our go-to. You guys know this. And they have like some of my favorite flavors. Also, cinnamon cookie batter. So freaking good in your coffee. So if you like like a caramel latte, definitely get this protein. It'll taste like the closest thing to um, having like a caramel latte in your coffee. Or if you like a little extra flavor, cinnamon cookie batter is really good. Or if you like cinnamon toast crunch, these flavors are really good. Or if you want to be in that like Christmas mood, we got peppermint bark. Or... Guys, I got options. We also have the pumpkin spice latte. So if you guys are a PSL a girly through and basic. through, um, if you feel a little basic, they have this as well. So I think I'm, today I'm gonna go for the cinnamon cookie batter because I mean, come on, it sounds amazing. Starting off with obviously the easiest one is literally just coffee. So all you need is your coffee that's already made. So your coffee in. Pretty basic, right? Then years later. Obviously this one's like super basic because all you're doing is putting the protein in the coffee. Um, but the thing is, is you, now you're not putting milk. You're not putting added sugar or like all the different like flavors. And this gives it so much flavor. So personally what I like to do, and this will be a little bit trial and error when you make it, is I would start off with just a little bit. Don't do a full scoop of protein, maybe just a little bit. Add it in. And then if you want more flavor or less flavor, next time you make your coffee, you can add or, you know. So, the key is to get one of these things. You can get them off Amazon. I feel like this just makes it all the better because it like froths it. So I'm gonna mix her up. I'm gonna froth her in there good. Make sure you guys wait till the end though because Katie B is going to show you the actual, the specialty. You know, this one's easy. It doesn't take a lot of experience. Like protein coffee. But I want to show you guys like if you are drinking coffee every single day and you add a whole bunch of sugar to it, how to make it healthy and how to make that one small change could literally cut out so many calories in your diet in a day. And you're getting and so your like, protein. And it has flavor. It tastes so good. It doesn't taste like a black coffee. It tastes... Like literally cookie batter. Coffee with the K might have to become a regular on the channel. I don't Dude, know. I, I literally love making coffee, especially protein coffee. So this one I'm gonna do cinnamon toast crunch, but we're gonna make Ooh, an Americano. Goodness. We're gonna do a hot Americano because it's a little chilly outside today. Not like cold, but it's not that yeah, hot. Make it warm. So come with me. Okay, so this one's really good if you guys have an espresso machine or if you guys have a Nespresso machine, then you just need your Nespresso shot cold. First things first, we're gonna grind the beans, get it ready to go. Grind them, hey, hey. Gonna <laughs> pat her down. Nice. Smash her down there. Smash her down, put her in, and pull mm. our freaking shot. Pull the lever cronk. Wrong lever. Bone apple tea, baby. Tea. Here's where the magic happens. I like to only wait 25 seconds on my uh, espresso machine if you have one. That's just personal, and I do a double shot. And that's then, all relative to the beans. Yeah, it, you know, it really- That's not a fair play right yeah. there. Yeah. And then also, if you have an espresso machine too, that works as well. You just gotta grab your like, like an espresso will look the same like this. Show them the cup, show them the cup. There's okay, the so shot. we have the- Ready to go. So, and then I'm gonna add, actually I'm gonna add the protein and then the hot water. Oh, she's so, in her element right now. Go ahead, Cinnamon man. toast crunch. And I'm gonna 
This is, I'm gonna show you guys how special touch. So about, about half a scoop half of that, scoop. right? Okay. Show them it, show them it as it melts in. Ooh. Right? I'm gonna add just a little dash of cinnamon on top. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, Look at that. This literally looks like a freaking latte. Once you have the water, and then we must froth. Oh <gasps> my gosh, Catherine McKinley. I didn't know I was gonna do that. Look at what she just did. I got a little too She got too excited with the You cannot tell me that that does not look like a nice latte. Like, or an Americano, like it. You know, your design Wait, isn't beautiful. Excuse like, me. The presentation isn't there, you know what I'm saying? But it, is it fire. tastes delicious. Bon appetit. Cheers. No, but I like it because it's like you're getting protein and it has flavor. Mm. Isn't that good? Delicious. Literally. Okay, and if you guys have seen our overnight oats video, literally uh, every single morning, Josh and I will make our coffee and then we'll have our oats together. Like that combination. I was just getting your protein say. in. It is so good. So if you guys haven't seen that, definitely make sure you guys check it out because that has been like our go to. This morning, we didn't make them. I was going to say, was this, so hurt. this is our combination. Usually, we'll do the overnight oats with the protein coffee. Mm -hmm. If for whatever reason, my amazing wife forgets to make the protein like oats, this morning, I like forgot. She did I was so sorry. Last night, um, but for this morning. Then I just eat a protein bar. These are my favorite, the peanut butter lover. They're really I love good because they're, so they're um, my favorite. meal replacements, which is really nice. And honestly, like the combination is just a really easy way to get your protein in. So I highly, highly recommend you guys try this out. Let us know if you do. Also, start small with the protein, and then like you can always add more. So depending on how much flavor you want too. So like if you're not used to like super sweet coffee, you don't want to add as much. Um, 100%. But then add the little and then add more. Also depends how much protein you want to get in. If yeah. you guys want to check out any of the first form products we talked about in this video, they are going to be linked down oh, below. Yeah. These are some of our go-to products for every day. Um, and then make sure you guys check out the overnight oats video as well. We love you guys. Stay savage. Don't be average. And Put them let's up. go. Put them up. Put them up. Put them up. Put them up. Put them up.